This is a CBS 4 News update. I'm Rudy Beshabazi with a CBS 4 News update. A security guard has been arrested and charged in the shooting of a woman at a busy shopping center in southwest Miami-Dade. 54-year-old Alejandro Cabrera Cruz appeared before a judge today on charges of manslaughter with a deadly weapon. Police say he was working as a security guard at the Seastone Shopping Center off southwest 184th Street when he shot a 62-year-old woman in the back. She was transported to Jackson South Medical Center where she later died. Investigators say Cabrera Cruz provided a full confession he remains in jail without bond. New details on the health of the oldest living president who just last month turned 95 years old. Former President Jimmy Carter is under observation at Emory Hospital in Atlanta following brain surgery this morning. The Carter Center says Mr. Carter is recovering from a procedure to relieve pressure from bleeding on his brain. A spokesperson says there were no complications from the surgery stemming from recent falls. About 70 percent of the country will experience record-breaking temperatures due to an increase Increase in an Arctic blast. Places from Chicago to parts of Tennessee are already being buried under unseasonable amounts of snow. More than 1,200 flights were canceled Monday at Chicago's O'Hare Airport. One American Eagle flight even slid off the runway. Freeze watches and warnings are extended as far as South Florida. Now, CBS 4 weather. And that cold air covers much of the nation, especially from the Rockies east to the east coast, but not quite into Florida yet. The cold air is going to make a run at Florida, but the front kind of fades out once it comes through on Wednesday. So some showers around, temperatures not as warm for your Wednesday. Highs right around 80. Then Thursday, we start to warm back up showers and storms by Friday, and then a stronger segment of that cold front comes through. That passes Friday night, so Saturday we do see temperatures drop. In fact, the forecast looks like this 80 for your Wednesday, a better chance for showers on Thursday, showers and storms likely on Friday, and then a big temperature drop for Saturday and Sunday, highs in the 70s. Lows could dip into the 50s by Sunday morning. Ruta Bay. All right, thank you very much. And that is our news for now. You can always find us on CBSMiami.com and tune into CBS 4 News at 5, 6, 7, and 11 for all of today's important headlines.